you got going on? Hey, Gabe. <laughs> well, good afternoon. Just us and everything. It's been about a week, maybe a little bit more than a week. Uh, there wasn't too much going on, so there wasn't really any inspiration to make a video. But today, we're going back to take Pookie to uh, see the horses. I think this time there will be a, a horse ride involved or something of that nature. Um, right now, the kids are outside playing with water and bound to get all wet. Oh, here's some poo-poo. We're going to pick up. Um... Yeah, it just hasn't been uh, hasn't been all that busy. Uh, like I said, when uh, when it comes to making videos now, I want to do stuff that is fun to watch. I, I doubt people want to see me, as I've mentioned in other videos, doing the same things every day, uh, cooking foods. Uh, cooking is fun, but I, I don't really do the whole like cooking video. Is that another piece of poop? Holy smokes! I gotta go on a pooper run. Um, you take a look at all the mint bursting forth from the garden. And the, uh, the grapevines are coming back. I have a lot of work to do in this backyard. A lot. And then I went to Oh, great. Um, so we're going to be doing a lot of trips to the nursery, getting a whole new bunch of plants, planting those. Try to revitalize this area, make it look beautiful again and lush. Happy to see that everything is growing back. Check out the green. Looks beautiful. There's, uh, well, there's this going on with the pool. All the trees dump all this, so it's, uh, it's becoming a little bit of a nightmare for the pool pump, having to back flush a lot. I'm sure that filter needs to be cleaned out. But, um, oh, dogs are going crazy about something. Um, but yeah, so that's the plan today. We're going to do the horse thing. We're going to have a little bit of a fiesta later. My son is really into the movie Coco. So we've been having a lot of fun playing the music from the movie Coco, watching Coco, uh, the movie that is. I have a dog named Coco. Um, and all those kind of fun stuff. So uh, gonna make it a fun video out of this. Horses, fiesta, kids playing. Just another day in the life of just us and everything. And uh, really excited to make a video today. I'm really glad you're coming along. And by the way, we're up to 90 subscribers. I can't believe it. So thank you to the 90th subscriber. I was waiting for you. I was stuck at like 89. I kept checking it. I almost got a little obsessive about it. Uh, not that I'm, you know, I, I would love to have a big following. Why not? But it's not really my, my aim. Uh, <laughs> but so like I said, I began doing this channel so that our family, which lives all over the world, could see what we're up to. And I wanted to make a record of my children's upbringing um, that they could watch when they're older and see what life was like when they were young. So that's the plan, and uh, let's get moving on the video today. Thanks for coming along. Our banana plants, our, our banana trees are making a return. There's two little ones right there. This big one is coming back. Those were the, the carcasses of the old banana trees. We started with one, then we had two. Now we're gonna have three. Kind of cool how that works. I have no idea what this stuff is called. I guess I could look at the stuff that falls from the tree. Pollen. It's everywhere. Look at this. Oh, they're even sweeping it. You guys doing that? Sweeping it into a corner over here? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Should use the broom. Do ya?
Good kick. I wanted to do a little room update for Pookie. We've been working on this room. We have the addition of a TV. Trying to do whatever we can to encourage her to, uh, to use her room. And it's a little bit messy right over here where all the toys are. We need to do a little bit of organizing, but she really enjoyed sitting in here last night watching the TV. She loves watching gaming videos on YouTube. Uh, one of the people she really loves is gaming with Kev. She used to really love Think Noodles, but she hasn't watched him in a while. But uh, most of the time, it's always gaming with Kev or anything related to Go Simulator 3. Some FGTV stuff. Um, me personally, the YouTubers that I watch, I think I've talked about this before, but uh, one of my all-time favorites is Adam the Woo. One of the reasons is we're around the same age and we have the same uh, love of movies from my favorite movie being 1978 original Superman with Christopher Reeve. And also movies like Back to the Future, The Goonies. I literally grew up watching those movies, Short Circuit. And then every time I watch him, he's in either going to someplace I love, which includes all the Disney theme parks. Uh, and I have a very tremendous deep respect for, for Walt Disney. I personally uh, read, I personally admire the man. I've read so many biographies, books about him. Uh, we have, uh, and uh, going to Disneyland, I grew up in Southern California, going to Disneyland. Oh, that reminds me, another YouTuber I watch is David Erickson uh, with Fresh Baked. Would love to run into them sometime, but don't ever want to bother any of these people because, you know, they're making their videos, they're doing their thing, and uh, just great, great content to watch. Adam especially, and he does a lot of road trips, and I love that. I love seeing old towns. So he and I have the most... Uh, in common, and so I, I, I watch him quite regularly. Um, but beyond that, I mean, uh, that's basically all I watch. Uh, I don't even watch TV. I mean, we watch like some movies like Coco, Disney movies. Uh, Tangled was, was really, really, really happening here in this house. We had to watch that multiple times, but um, yeah, so anyways, it distracted myself. I always get distracted. Room update is coming along. Things are falling into place as spring approaches, and man, we're going to Disneyland in May. I'm so excited. So, uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. I also like to get out to Disney World sometime. Um, not sure when that's going to happen, but it will happen. Also, make a trip out to Arizona, where my sister lives, and I love Arizona. Beautiful. She lives in a little town called Cave Creek. So, we'll be doing that, and I'll be making videos of all that stuff. And uh, I'll be extremely excited to share those with you. So, and like I always say, thank you so much for watching our videos. And uh, let's see how much fun we could have while making these and while watching them and, and doing all that kind of good stuff. So. And we're ready. You, you got Woody the cowboy. Mm. That's appropriate. We are off to the horse place. I'm sure it's better name than calling it the horse place, really. Yeah, I don't know what the word, the right word is. The horse. The equus. The, the, the horse farm. Center. The horse. The barn. What? What is it? What is the place where you pull horses? What do you call it? Oh, I'll, I'll tell you. The horse state. The stables. No. Stables, yes. I'm pretty sure. Whoa, look at all that stuff from the... oh. Anyways. I don't know how to pronounce it. There it is. Equestrian. Caligari Equestrian Center. Caligari Equestrian Center. We're off. <laughs> I'm not exactly sure what we're going to do. I think she's going to ride a horse. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see what happens. All right. Right, we made it. To the stables. I'm not even gonna attempt to try to say the name of this place. Oh, look, there's a rider over there. Well, we're gonna see what how this goes. Should be interesting. Are you excited? Mm -hmm. Alright, let's go. Let's go find Megan. 
I know, they're all in there. Some big, beautiful ones too, can't really see them. Hi, a pretty horse. Hello. There's the name of the place. The Caligari Equestrian Club. Beautiful horse. Uh, no, that looks like it's uh, sawdust. Yeah, go around this way. That's where we went last time. Yeah, that's where I found. Oh yeah, you stayed. I didn't say. All right, do you want to go potty before we go, or are you okay? With the braids. Mm -hmm. She was just telling me that she played a horse. Oh, game. She had braids like that horse. They're so pretty. And Robux, Roblox. Don't the Clyde still have the white? I have no there? idea. I have no idea. Fur hair. I don't even know how you know. I mean, the only thing I know about horses is from Red Dead Redemption. <laughs> because I think in Kansas City, the Clydesdale, they bring the, the carriages around, stand up in the plaza. I'm getting shy. So the horse that they get for Pookie's name is Duke. So we're gonna we're gonna go say hi to Duke. Let's go say hi to Duke. Okay. Oh, look at those blue eyes. So pretty. Look at his eyes. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. He's big. What about that horse? Mm -hmm. Megan, you don't mind if I record, right? Oh, okay. I love his eyes. Isn't he beautiful? Oh, oh, your eyes. He's so yeah, pretty. Yeah, we're twins. Yeah. He's, this is my son. Oh, my goodness. Ten years. He was a show horse for a while, and he's really? retired now. He went to championships. Oh. He worked real hard. Hi. Isn't he pretty? Look at, oh, he's saying hi. Look at his eyes. He's pretty. He's so pretty. He just wants to see you. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> just, he's just trying to be like affectionate. You see um, that? It, I get it though. It's like a dog getting in your face. It's, hey man. Can I horse, say hi to him? Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Horses are good at personal boundaries. Like he, he's pretty good about it. If you tell him no. He's been like, it's kind of fun because he gets, he's been the first ride for so many kids over the years. Oh, that's good. Like, they, their very first time you on a horse. Say hi to Maybe put out your hand and go. Yeah, he's saying hi. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, Horses are very expressive, so he's just, he'll just kind of be like, you're getting dust on you, my brush the dust in your face. Oh, I see. Boy. Good boy. Huh? Are you a good boy? I wipe your eyes off. He's about 20, like 21, 22. Mm -hmm. Horses can live up to like in their 40s typically. But you, I mean, usually the lifespan is about 30. We'll probably have another five good years out of him. Hopefully, he had an injury, his back leg that kind of. Oh, this was the one. Yeah. So he's all better now. Yeah. I remember that. I would... He was hurt. Which he, oh yeah, because we were looking at all the horses. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is him. 
Wow, I'm glad he's better. Yeah. You were a little scared about yeah. that, I remember. How many horses are here? Probably about a hundred. Wow. I'm sorry. Hi. So it should be kind of tight on them. Okay. To the point where they're kind of like, eh. Um, that's so that they, um, they yeah, I think they should be able to fall under so low right now. So you don't bump your head and get yeah, hurt. It's like a bicycle. Mm -hmm. You're not gonna fall. I'd be shocked. I'd be astonished. As soon as someone goes in there to ride, though, there's no foot traffic. Okay, so, I have to so that means you have to stay outside there. But but okay. you can go in there to help me get her on. Okay. I think that'll make her feel a little more confident. You're gonna hold on. Sorry. I'm gonna have a hold of okay. him. Yeah, no, okay. she. Okay. So I'm gonna come up through here. So you want to step out of the way. Yeah, Horses cannot see in front of their faces directly so or right here okay. so if he can't if he's walking and then someone pops up they're like where did that come from i mean they're more perceptual of that but i'm just saying right. it's just a general so as he's coming over here you gotta scoop because horses are like 1200 pound animals they can't see they can't stop like moving so if you're not if you're not far away and any horses that's just horse safety and any horse walks by you need to get out of their way don't stand behind them. Should I stay out here? Yeah, yeah. Okay, stay I'll stay. Are you coming in here? Yeah. Okay. Just stay out.
okay. Then. Would you? Yeah. Totally. Mm -hmm. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I have ridden a horse, but. I have one. But it was in a very controlled yeah. ride. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Come on, dude. Good boy. Thanks. <laughs> With her popsicle ice cream dress on. <laughs> Now it's just confidence building because yeah. they're big animals and when they do, when you fall, it hurts. So yeah. you want to try to avoid that till you get where you're like me, where you're like, I still like this more than falling. Right. <laughs> but um, just like all, like a lot of this and then when they get a little older and more confident, that's when they start to get the reins and stuff. Mm -hmm. I mean, there's places you probably go where they're like following a line. Um, they're not riding, they're a passenger on a horse that just is following the horse in front of them, even if they have the reins. Mm -hmm. um, but, you know, ro most riding schools, the aim is to teach them to ride the animal. Mm -hmm. So, but the hugging grooms are kind of that preschool, yeah. kind of kindergarten level. Mm -hmm. just, do you, can you let go of the saddle? Try it. If, there you go. You, yeah, if you want to ride a horse without, without any feet, you can't hold on to the saddle. Yeah, nervous, yeah. <laughs> sitting on a horse and I want him to go that way I tell him with this leg if I want him to go that way I tell him with this leg and then I kind of balance it with the bridle how the degree I want him to go and so you can do like you can change the dimensions of your circle just by how you close your hip and they're very sensitive to that once they're trained mm -hmm. but really so that's kind of like if you're steering with leg her leg needs to be here mm -hmm. right? for Ha <laughs> ha. 
Yeah, what did you it like it? Like a horse. You feel like a horse? You want to brush it a little bit more? High five. I don't know if you are. Can you ask her? I don't think so. I'll ask her. We went up there with, with the, Megan, can she walk up into the viewing platform? Where? Right up here on the viewing platform. Okay. You did it. You rode a horse. So what did you think? Yeah. Were you excited? Yeah. Excited. yeah. What, are you, what are you doing? <laughs> yes, you're very tall, but please be careful. Why? Why? Yeah, why? I know you like to climb on everything these days because you're up real high. Higher in a building? No. Um, do you wanna? Did you wanna go pet, brush him off a little bit, or? Oh yeah. We don't have much longer. We gotta go. Hi Duke. Hi Duke. Hi. You're such a sweet horse. Yeah, be very gentle. Sorry. Well, we'll come back. You like this, right? We're going right? to come back again and do it again. You're on camera again. Because <laughs> I ride a horse. You did it. Like Eva, just like Eva used to. Yeah, I sent. I'll send her all the pictures. But did Eva live here? No. She did it in California. Yep. Right. Onward to the dinner fiesta. fiesta. Well, that is all for this video. We hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe, and we will see you soon. Thanks for watching.